What's up, everyone? It's your boy Giovanni, the G35 fan, back at it again with another video on the channel. So, for today's video, guys, I thought I'd just give you a little up to date what's going on with the G35, what's going on with why am I doing so many vlogging videos, uh, give you an up to date on some of the modifications that I've done to the car, how they're holding up, because uh, a lot of the videos I do. I try out products and sometimes they work, sometimes they don't. And I just thought I'd give you my feedback on what's going on so far with the ones that I've done recently. And um, that's pretty much it, guys. But like always, been talking too much. So let's get the video started. Alright, guys. So first of all, just want to give a shout out. To all the new subscribers, thank y'all guys for subscribing. Hopefully, uh, y'all get entertained with some of my videos. Hopefully, they uh, help you in some type of way, whether it be on modifications that I've done to the G, or whether it be on uh, videos on fixing, you know, maintenance stuff as far as the car. Whatever it is, guys, thank y'all for showing your support. Um, I did do a recent poll, and on that poll. I had asked how many of my subscribers watch my vlogging videos. Well, I got a brutally honest response from my subscribers, which, hey, it doesn't hurt my feelings. That's why I did the poll. I wanted to get some feedback from y'all guys. Thank y'all for leaving y'all's comments. Well, not comments, but putting y'all's input and y'all's thoughts. But I found out that mo the majority of my subscribers are here for G35 content, which is cool. Hey, that's what I base my channel on, the G35. Um, now, the reason why I've been doing a lot of blogging videos lately, guys, well, if you do watch my blogging videos, for those who watch them, y'all know who y'all are. Thank y'all for showing your support. But I always mention in the video that I'm just trying to, you know, document and uh, just record as much as I can um, watching my baby boy grow up. Now, he's already going to be six months. As as of yesterday, he was six months. Uh, so, a whole half year, a whole year and a half, a whole half of a year. There you go. A whole half of a year has passed already that he's been on this earth. And it's going by fast. So, I'm just trying to document everything. But the reason why I've been doing a lot of vlogging videos lately, there's three things, guys. One, yes, I want to document everything and just, you know, go back and watch videos that, uh, you know, I could look back on when he was a baby. Two, I'm trying to work on my people, um, people skills and, you know, just being more comfortable out and about with the camera. Um, and three, um, I, it's because it's December, guys. Um, I'm trying to save my money. Well, not save my money. I'm trying to use my money toward, uh, you know Christmas gifts and up uh, and you know bills and stuff. I haven't really been putting money away for you know the G35 I'm pretty much just doing everything for Christmas. This is my favorite holiday. So uh, You know, I'm trying to spend my money on giving gifts away and you know doing all that for the family um, So I haven't really been selfish and got stuff for the car but there, I've already looked at um, some items that I'm already going to purchase as far as next month at the beginning of the year because I am going to start second phase on the G35. I'm really excited. Hopefully, I get everything done right. Uh, if there's stuff that I can't do as far as suspension and stuff, then, you know, I'll have somebody professional do it or somebody who knows how to do it, um, you know, finish it for me. But more than likely, I'm going to try to do whatever I can with the tools I have to, uh, you know, work on the suspension and stuff. So I already have um, the front and rear sway bars ready to order. I just got to hit that, you know, order and boom, there you go. Next week, I'll get them or whenever I put the order in. But I already have it in my cart ready to go. So um, that's not going to happen till next year, like in the beginning of January when you know, I can, you know, start spending money back on the car. So I'm really excited to, you know, put those on. I haven't seen any videos on it yet as far as on the all-wheel drive. I tried looking up videos. It's pretty much on the rear-wheel drive G35s. So, I mean, it shouldn't be that hard. It looks, you know, like you remove and replace. 
the the thing that I think I'm gonna have trouble with is you know just making sure that I get it done right and having everything back to the way it was because this is my only vehicle that I use for work I know April has her you know her family car the one that we got but that's for appointments and for her when it comes to using this vehicle as just you know to go to work this is my only vehicle so being that we do have the other car I can start messing with this car now but I just got to make sure I always keep it going and running because I don't want it to be down because that would kind of suck so yeah I I'm really looking at sway bars so I'm really excited about that the only thing I'm concerned about is maybe y'all can help me if y'all if y'all are still watching the video and I haven't been put to sleep yet um, I'm trying to find the uh, stabilizers for my car I don't know if there's like a difference I was looking at threads on the you know infinity and Nissan's you know website uh, trying to figure out if I can use the uh, rear wheel drive stabilizers or do I need to have just all wheel drive stabilizers or is it just best to keep the ones that are on the car? Uh, so if y'all know anything about that, let me know. Um, I did reach out to some of the, um, I guess, like Z1 Motorsport. I had asked them. They had like a performance style and they got back with me and they said no, that these wouldn't work. So I'm trying to figure out you know, if I should just stay with the original ones or if I need to upgrade them because when I get the new sway bar, it's going to be a beefier, you know, sway bar and a lot thicker. So I don't know if I need to have, you know, better uh, sports, you know, I, I don't know. I, I don't know if I need to have better, better stuff to accommodate the, uh, you know, the bigger, beefier um, sway bars. That being said, uh, so yeah, that's what's going on. So if if y'all are inter interested in the G35 content, I do got some coming up, but it's not going to be till January. I do have some other videos pertaining the G35, but uh, as far as actual stuff that I'm going to start doing on the car, uh, I'm just saying, you know, it won't be till January. That's what I'm looking at. So just wanted to get that out of the way, get out the whole blogging thing. Um, let's talk about some of the recent modifications that I've did to the car and how are they holding up so I did a recent picture and I had asked everyone what's wrong with this picture now from the picture looking at it guys um you can't really tell and that kind of sucks because I was trying to get you know what was wrong in the photo but for the most part guys that LED uh emblem that I got it's already all dim like it's not fully bright like some of the lights already went out um, I did power wash the vehicle the other day at the car wash but all my connections are good the lights still work but now they're just real dim like it's I don't know it's I don't know if it's I got a faulty one and you know it just already went bad or it's just a poorly made product or something but um it's not as bright as it used to be it's a little dim it still looks nice guys not gonna lie it still looks good but um yeah it's 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 already lost some of the leds on the whole uh emblem and it's kind of hard to tell in that photo but that's what was wrong with it the led emblem is you know going out already that kind of sucks the second thing guys i am i installed a front um four-piece splitter that i had to customize oh man i love the way it looks it I've gotten compliments on it. But uh yeah, well, being that it's a front splitter, if y'all know how it is with front splitters, these cars are already low. So they're doing construction over here by my house, and there's just enough of a dip where it can scrape. Well, uh me being an idiot just thought, oh, it's just a little and I ended up breaking off the red part on the front splitter. So I had to customize it and I got it on there, but it's not the way it used to be. It's, it looks a little different. And then the front um, fog lights that I got that were like, I forgot how much they were. They were real cheap, guys. And that was a really in simple install. And those are ho holding up good, man. And those things are bright, dude. I really like those. And um, for, for the price that I got them for, I would recommend getting them. Uh, they're really bright and yeah, they made your car look a lot uh, sportier when, when it comes to the fog lights. But uh, other than that, guys, that's pretty much it. I didn't want this to be a long video. It's already almost 10 minutes long. Sorry about that, but I did want to uh, let y'all know what was going on 
with the channel and just uh, say thanks guys so like always guys if y'all enjoyed this video put that thumbs up if you haven't yet subscribed please subscribe right down below the video I do got some more G35 content guys that was the main thing I got more content coming out so bear with me and just you know show your support and watch some of the blogging videos guys come on I mean you're gonna get to see uh you know inside my life as far as other stuff besides the G35 you get to you know April is getting a lot more um you know camera friendly and you know she she was really shy but now I'm getting her into the you know into the blogs and now my baby's in the blogs and you know it is what it is guys if y'all enjoy it then you know you watch it if not then it uh you know then whatever i mean i'm not gonna get hurt i'm still gonna do videos but uh that being said guys y'all have a great day y'all stay safe out there and uh yeah that's pretty much it guys like always it's your boy giovanni peace